Justice Ruby Opio Aweri is the first judge in Uganda's history to be accorded a state barrio. To many, he truly deserved it given his long legacy in the judicial system of Uganda. He earned this. We've never given to him as a favor. The justice who we have come to pay tribute to has left fruits in this world at the national level, at the local government level, but also here at family level. To many, especially those in the Lango sub region, Justice Aweri was highly regarded as a champion of environmental conservation. He planted trees and gave all of us trees and taught us how to plant them. And he would ensure that you planted the trees he gave you, you cared for them, and he would supervise you and inspect them. I'm sure that he did a lot of work to ensure that this place remains the way it is. You can see the, 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 the lake, and then you see the grass that is besides the lake. The Bishop of Lango Diocese, Bishop Alfred Olua, while leading service at the funeral, commended Justice Aweri for living an exemplary life. He didn't fight over preferences. Often he even didn't fight for his own so-called rights. President Museveni, who was represented by the Vice President Jessica Alupo, described the late Aweri as one of the high judicial officers with integrity. Throughout his long career, the late Justice Ruby Opio Aweri remained humble, steadfast, and impartial in the execution of his judicial responsibilities. Some leaders from the Lango sub-region called for consideration from the government for the replacement of the position at the Supreme Court with another person from the sub-region. We shall be very proud of assurance from your office being the appointing authority of having a replacement of an office that is equal or near equal to the same. The Chief Justice Alphonse Owindolo, however, quashed the request, saying Justice Aweri and his position. In the judiciary, we never appoint somebody to replace another. No. You qualify, and then you are appointed. Reports indicate that by the time of his death, Justice Aweri had written a notice to retire from the judicial service in 2023 after serving there for close to 40 years. Nelson Omoya, NTV Weekend Edition.